everyone, welcome back. And this week I'm doing a boots haul. I went and got loads of points on my Advantage card and got myself some lovely things to try. I've not really tried most of these things yet. So if you know anything about them, then please let me know in the comments section below. I am going with my husband um, soon. He's, he's a workaholic, bless him. And I try and get him away to a desert island for a week, but we still have Wi-Fi and Skype. Love him to pieces, but he loves his work. Um, anyway, because of that, I've got some little bits in here that I'm going to take with me. But anyway, let's first start, first of all, with my favourite, probably my favourite body butter of all times. I have used this. It's a Sanctuary Luxurious Body Butter, and I'm going to be taking this with me. This I've used for years, and it's my go-to favourite for the winter as well. I only have to smell this. And I'm just in a spa. I love it, I love it, I love it. So that's gorgeous and the texture's fantastic. And I am going to take the whole tub with me, blow the weight, that's going with me. So that one's great. Now I'm going on to hair next. This is Charles Worthington. I haven't seen these before. This is thicker and fuller conditioner. They do do shampoo, but I like to use a bit of a colour save thing for my hair most of the time. But I thought I'd try this because I could really do some help with hair thickening at the moment. I'm trying all sorts of things, so I'm going to be using that. Um, I also saw this Trevor Sorby. This is a volume thickening spray, and it's in a little ha handy travel size. So I'm going to take that. And again, I'm always looking for that volume because my hair is so flat. Um, oh, this looks nice. This is the Dove Oxygen for fine flat hair that's me and this is a root lift spray i've tried this dove oxygen i've tried the hair mask and i loved it oh my god it's light as a feather but gave you such volume so i'm going to try that i'm looking forward to that um then because i'm going to because i want to sort of have a bit of a beachy wave i thought i'd try this um this is beach blonde sea waves and just spritz a bit of my hair to give it a bit a bit of texture sometimes um, I know if you've got frizzy hair, this is the last thing you'd want, but when you've got fine hair like me, you'll try anything. So I'm going to try that. I also picked up a lovely, again, travel size. I haven't tried this. This is the OGX. I've tried their coconut. This is the Argan Oil of Morocco conditioner, and I kind of fancied trying that. I love the, the colour of the packaging as well. Sucker! Um, let's go on to skincare. Now, something that I've read about for ages but never actually tried and it seems to have got a track record of being proven to help with all the anti-aging things is the number seven protect and perfect intense advanced serum um, th when this came out it sold off the shelves didn't it everybody just went mad for it but I've never actually purchased it so I'm going to try that I'm going to try it it's supposed to continue going for um, this one has instant effects but then keeps at, um, keeps helping for the future if that makes sense. So that's my new serum. I always like to use an anti-aging serum and that's the next one I'm going to try. To keep myself lovely and clean and fresh, I picked up one of these. This is by Dove. They've got a new range out. This is this one is the, um, the berry one um, and it's, it literally does smell. Oh my goodness, it smells of berries and I've never actually had a shower wash that does that. Um, it's really moisturising, it says soft to smooth or even after just one shower. So that's again going to help with my drier skin, which I'm finding I've got the older um, I've become. So yeah, there are other ones within the range, but I fancied the berry one, so that's the new shower thing. Um, what else did I get? Oh, never forget your hands. People write to me and say, what's best for your hands? What can I do? Um, obviously all the SPFs, hand cream at every stage. Every time you wash your hands, you lose moisture from your hands, so you need to be putting some kind of hand cream moisture on them. So I picked up this Dove Pro Age Nourishing Hand Cream, and this claims it helps with age spots, and boy oh boy, it's got a bit of a job on here. But I've already tried some, you know me, I like to swatch everything. Girls laugh at me all the time, everything you have is swatched. Feels really nice, smells lovely too, and so again, I'm going to take that away with me as well and keep trying that. It does feel really nice actually, So, and it's a handy size for your handbag in the car. So that's going with me. Then I quickly bought a bit of makeup too. Forgive me, I have to put my glasses on. I got some makeup. I'm trying to be a bit bolder in, in terms of my lip at the moment. Um, you can see I've got a bit of a red thing going on here. This is more of um, uh, a pinky red, um, which is 
probably more the tones that suit me. Um, lip, liner, lip Liner Couture by L'Oreal in their colour rouge and it's in 461 Scarlet Rouge. So I'm loving that lip liner um, and, I'll, and I'll, put, I'll do close ups and stuff so you can see that. This is L'Oreal Paris's um, gloss but for a change I'm going for a matte gloss and this is number 405. If I wanted to make it glossy, you can always buy that clear gloss and add it over the top. But I'm going to try that for a bit of a change with that lip liner and I'll let you know how I get on. But that's a beautiful, it's like a fuchsia pink, but it's not as bright. So it's probably more of a, a pinky red. So I'm loving that. And then lastly, for my nails, I saw, um, I saw these, they're Sunset Daylight Curing by Barry M. They had a lovely colour range and I thought for the winter I'd have this purple and I thought for the winter I'd have this purple which is called Plum On Baby right okay um, so I'm going to be popping that on my nails and using that on my toenails probably and my fingernails as a winter colour so that's all my purchases from Boots I've got loads of points and I'm looking forward to trying it all out hope you've liked it if you have please give it a massive thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and if any of you have got any of comments on any of these products I'd love to hear from you I'll see you next week. Bye! And I love things like that. Um, so it's got the camel stripe then with the black. Fitted, midi, lovely. I thought with black opaques, and I'm going to get some sort of brown boots probably to wear with that.